So here with Jasper, how do you find Tuesday night, mate? Yeah, no, it was great because obviously quite a few of us have been there and obviously a bit of bragging rights. We all wanted to go prove something and show off in the performance. The team performance, everyone gave 110%. Even the shape, it looked like we've been doing it for ages. I think it just shows what this Worthing team's capable of and that sort of performance we have to take into the last nine games. Treat every game like it is a, a game in a semi-final or a cup final. And yeah, no, it was a great buzz. Even though we lost, everyone was disappointed, but that level of performance has to continue. So how important is it going into the last nine games to keep that level of performance going? And, and obviously we, we've got it in us, we've got capable of doing it, but how, how important is it? Yeah, it's absolutely crucial. Obviously these last nine games are going to be nine cup finals, essentially. We don't want to be in a position where we're relying on other results. We just want it to be completely in our hands, which it is at the moment. And I believe we'd not these last nine games, we can win all nine. And hopefully, yeah, at the end of those nine games, we'll be lifting the league title. Fingers crossed. Yeah. So obviously, you've been in and out of the team um, in the past months, and then you've come into a nice run of games over the last uh, few weeks or so. How's it, how's it been for you, like being more involved with the first team? Yeah, no, it's great. I love being involved and being able to play is a massive privilege. And just having like a manager like who backs you, and especially being as young as I am, mm -hmm. being able to put the confidence in me to go out and I try and repay that by delivering my performances and but it's nice to be playing out there especially with the amount of crowd we get and yeah it's, it's a great feeling so how uh, how important is Hinch in terms of um, his managing style and how he's had put trust in you uh, how, how important is he to in terms of how you perform and, and your performance recently yeah no it's extremely important because obviously he's he's around everywhere he's not just doesn't take care of the first team you see him with the 13s the 14s the development squad he does the academy mm. and it just shows that there is that pathway there and being able to approve that with the amount of young players we put in the squad really does fill your confidence and think, yeah, no, I'm going to get my chance and when I get out, I've got to take it. So, yeah, no, it's great to have someone like that around. And talking of pathway, obviously your second year academy now. Yeah. Um, how are you finding that? What's the what's the journey been like? And uh, how was obviously last year all the way out to the first team now? Yeah. How's, how have you found it? Yeah, no, it's great because obviously it's just a group of boys who all love playing football in the class and together, banter flying about. I mean, we do our... Sport VTech, which again is everything to do with sport. Lauren's great, the tutor. It's, it's just a good environment to be in and, and then being able to train every day and then train with the first team manager, then hopefully get get selected for the squad on Saturday. And it just shows that that pathway is there and mm -hmm. a number of young players who have been selected for the first team and the academy plays a big part in that. And your target for the last nine games personally? Lots chipping with a few more goals. So to be an attacking player, Goals and assists is crucial, so I'd like to chip in with a few more goals, continue my run in the side, and then kiss that beautiful trophy at the end of the season. Fantastic, thank you. Thank you.